welcome back today in this video let us discuss about how to raise exceptions or warning in order 16 development in some case in some cases we need to raise messages to inform the user and stop the program execution if something happens in the expected workflow in order 16 we can do this by raising some exceptions Mainly there are different type of exceptions such as validation error, user error, access error, missing error, access, access denied error, etc. So, in our scroll management module, and this is my scroll management module, here we can see a menu exam, where I can create exam records. So, when I create a new record, here I can enter the student detail, and based on the student this class, here we can enter the subject and there is a field for exam fee where we can enter the fee for the exam. So if uh, for this record, if the fee is not entered, let's try to uh, add a warning message or try to raise a exceptions to inform the user to add to inform the user to enter the valid exam fee. So let's check how can we do this by raising some exceptions. For that, let's go to the PyCharm. So here in my school management module, in the exam.py Python file. First of all, let's import the validation error. We can import the validation error from order.exceptions and import validation error. So let's try with the validation error first. So for that, uh, I'm just defining a API constraint method. It will work while we create while we save this record and then the field is fee. And if there is no fee, so uh, if not self dot v, then we can raise the exception. So first uh, let's start with the validation error. So raise validation error. Here we can add the message. So the validation error is imported from, from order of exceptions and in the corresponding constraints, the validation error is raised. Then let's run the PyCharm. Go to the UI. Try to create a new exam record. Close the student. So now I make this exam field as empty. Try to save this record. So the validation error will be get as a pop up, which the message that we added will be shown at here. End of the exam memo. So let's try with another error type that is user error. So here we can use. In run the picture. Try to do the same step. So here the user error will be shown at here. And also another type of error that is access error, which is based upon the access. Access error will be shown it. Likewise, we can raise exceptions or warning to inform the user the appropriate messages which helps to stop the program execution if some happens for or some interruptions will occur for our expected workflow. 
That's all about the idea of how to raise exceptions or warning in order 60.